What is up, everyone? Welcome back. My general here has uh, done well in his defense, and uh, he's, his traits show it. I'm just gonna max out the uh, infantry, or you know, the war exercises tree, step one. Um, even though it's a naval, it's probably not wise now that I think about it, but it just, I don't know if it's a completionist thing, but I just hate leaving these, uh, universal bonuses up here, 3% replenishment rate for all armies and three, and fleets, I just, that kind of stuff. So tempting. I probably shouldn't do it though, should I? Because Navy, what? Not in, uh, not in, uh the land of German. But, uh... Well, what's the alternative? That's the key. We could build stables, which would actually be nice. Uh, make a choice. I will go... Uh, you know what? I do kind of like this. The horse. Okay, so where was I at here? He's re he's thinking about what he's done. And he I'm just gonna get a couple not the brethren, but the pure levy. Um get them on track here and just try to get this over and done with. Um and uh get this get this two part area done so that uh because this actually isn't part of my victory condition, I believe, not owning this. Or a sub. Like, this is the overall objective for chapter one. And then these are the th subsequent bonus, you know, non mandatory, but if you can, then that's good. Um, sub objectives. And uh, one of them is to control an entire. Uh, entirety of a one province and I am fighting for this province here because I was already at war with them and um, but it's actually not part of it's not one of the three that will give me a bonus um, Swabia proper um, it's got three different factions though um, two of which I have no fighty fight clauses with so I that would just be too hard Silesia though this is why I think I really wanted to uh, Attacked Luigi Breaths up here anyway, because it's owned. This whole province is owned by one faction, um, and will lead to a bonus for me. So, I, you know, that's why I want to wrap these guys up here and get them, uh, get them whipped, so I can uh, focus up here. Fortunately for me, they haven't, uh, you know, invaded yet. Um, it's going much slower than it should be going, but. It is going, so uh, with that note, ooh, you delicious Sighild, I remember you. Um, how many turns? Five turns. Turn around. Okay, so I won't do that anymore. I will make them while well, they're out of turns. Alright, here we go. Let's see if these guys uh, pursue me. I just did the defense, though. And they did their little retreat activities. So yeah, they should be going back home. Ooh. The plot. Plotins. I believe I just saw a faction here that said Bastardos. I'm pretty sure. I could be wrong. I'm probably not, but I could be. Here we go. Look at this. Glorious. They're devious bastards, though. Who are they at war with? They are at war with the Helvetii. Slaves and Swakani. I. You know what? Marco, you're not a bad guy. We got New Carthage, Persia representing. Oh, damn, that's gonna leave a mark. I am getting subterfuge like no other. 
I should be doing it to them, shouldn't I? Shouldn't I? Uh, since I believe I did try this and it didn't do anything. But he's not good at inciting unrest. He'll just, he'll just get wounded. Mm. I'm going to try and build this skill. There we go. Good, good. Resume the position. Don't want to, don't have the public order necessary to uh, start expanding yet. How is the culture here in good old Hernia? 96% Gallic. But lowering, I believe. Lowering. Incorrect. Celtic and rising. Pagan and dying. And I've got. That is insanity. I had to build a. Well, I didn't. Whatever. We'll see. Uh, nah, nah, nah. Alright. Ending the turn. Yes. Agents. Agents. Question mark. Okay, yeah, one. Alright. So we will have a rebellion posting there. And I shall smite them. I don't know if that is Seasons and Wonders, or if that's just always been there. I believe that's Seasons and Wonders. Quit subverting, you f bastard. Bithynia. That always makes it think of Conan, like Chimeria or whatever that is. Isn't what was he from? Conan? He's from Cimarron or Cinnamon. <laughs> it's not Burning Man, you animals. I mean, I guess that's what Burning Man looks like. I don't see any drugs, but other than that, I'm pretty sure that's accurate. They are using their agents well. Good for them. Marco died. Oh. So now I believe I'm immobilized. Incorrect. Shield Maiden. Dispatch. 23. Or 20. I shall try to manipulate. 23%. That's terrible. But, uh, see, okay, 23%, when I read this, 23% means 23% chance of succeeding in this coercion attempt. But then you, like, tooltip over it, and uh, you see, uh, th right there, positive outcome percentage, 77% to either stop it, the enemy, or to defect their combined. So, I don't get this difference between 23% here, and then the tooltip says 77% actually. Wait, okay, yeah. So we'll just see. I mean, according to this, 77% chance of victorious outcomes. We shall see, won't we? Defections! Bethlehem face. Sig hailed again, you glorious woman. And it's. She did convert him because he feared death. That's a beautiful thing. Rebel scum. We've got oath sworn. Oh, it's fun. I'm sure his units are great, but he's only got four. And so I should just be able to seriously outnumber them. We shall, shall we? Yes, we shall see. Clicking now. Blood. You cowardly bastard. Hmm. I guess that makes sense that you would do that. I will pursue. Man. I wonder how many units I'll lose. Look at that. 86% remaining. With all my nubbins here. These are the brethren. These are the bros. I got one unit of spirit levy. They've got no missile. That's incorrect. They've got one. 
this is ridiculous. But I still am going to auto-resolve it because I'll have time to recuperate. Yeah! Mm. Ding. Kill them all. The consorts of Friho lay. You want lots of things. We shall give you the horde because as we discussed earlier, You remember. And... How are we doing personnel-wise? You know, where's, uh, where's good old... Uh, oh, he got subverted, did he? Or no, he already went. So they've got 6,000 units of... That's what I was going to look up. Because I kept seeing the, uh, the uh, you know, the garrison force of 6,000 men, but then I'm like, well, wait. And so I'd always retreat, but then I'm like, well, wait a scooch here. There's a... I believe they're called this. I could be wrong. I don't want to look up... I just want to uh, kill, actually. I'm not going to lie. I just want to kill. But... I'll give him one more turn to restock. Well, that's foolish. I'm going to take this punk now. Die. That's what you get for sprinting. That's what they get for sprinting. They knew that, though. They knew that. And we'll go fortify. And go. Wow, 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 wow. That's not a knife. Pontus. Boy? Shall we hack at each other? Uh, no, because you're a unreliable expansionist bastard. And you're at war with Luigi and me and the slaves. No. Sorry, boy. <laughs> That's ridiculous. Athens. Syracuse. Conan's clan there. Yes! Thank you for reminding me, friends. I have I've just gotten so used to being utterly rejected that I've stopped pursuing the but now now on this turn I shall I shall uh, look into that. Now who is this? Now he's got a what is this guy? Bethlehem. One, two, three, four. He's got a, he's a six star going ooh. Always a higher star. But, this is like where uh, tag teaming activities I learned my last campaign. Seasons and Wonders. My last campaign, I really got into the whole thing of uh, these passive abilities that you can activate for the agents. If you read, hopefully you can. Um, you know, in general, in life, I mean, reading. It's awesome. Um, but these uh, tooltips give you, it tells you if you activate it, what does it do? And different versions of agents, like champions are zeal based, usually, I think, always scout spies are cunning based, and then your diplo mats are authority based, or your champions, wait a minute, I don't know. But they're all based in something, usually, based on one of the traits. So, yes, the spy will do, he uh, protects against cunning activity against you. And and it also matters too. I'm pretty sure this is correct. If you if you have your agent and you're gonna put him in passive mode like this, where it's a free, you know, if your if your agent that you're doing this in is in your own region, it's a defensive thing. It protects you against them being cunning or them being zealous on you. However, if you come over to, you know. Bad guyville. Well, if you come out here and do it in enemy territory, and you do it, I th hopefully we'll be able to illustrate. So now, if I set up town, if I set up shop, now it wreaks despair on their populace. It's the same thing. So it doesn't. It's not only protective or only offensive or defensive. It depends on where your agent is. Um, and so, since 
So what I would like to do, preferably this whole fiasco would be going on over here because then this agent, this punk here, would be trying this over here and I would be able to, so you can get offensive with your agents. Like you can, you set up your spy out here on the passive and it makes everyone in this region vulnerable to cunning activities. And so then with your non-passive agent, the one you're actually going to use an active money skill on, now you have a higher percent chance of finishing whatever you're going to do because your other agents are kind of supporting passively all their activities. It's really, I mean, it's like, I don't know, it's probably, well, no duh, but like I really was using that in my Egypt campaign. Um, I was using that, I, I was taken over, not like all the time, but there was some, two, three, I think, regions that I captured through inciting unrest and everything and we just went so much faster and was because the percent to be successful every single turn was higher when I was working together than when I just had the one like this you know white wolf down here is that still yeah white wolf he's still down here like every turn by himself trying stuff and it's successful but you know it's just it's just better working together so I guess the whole point of that fiasco was. So anyway, uh, I'm going to... what shall I do? I don't... and I think there's like some hard fixes in this too, like if you got this enemy down to one agent left, no matter how skilled you are, you can have a 10 star or whatever going against their one star agent. I might be wrong, but it just seems like you're trying to get that last agent to convert, and it they just won't. It will always fail. You know, failure, failure. And you're like, well, dude, I just converted all six of his spy brothers, and now I can't get this last nub recruit to convert, and I've got this monstrous badass. Freaking Sighild, she's look at her. I dare you. Stare. Look at that. Siggy pop. Yeah. Anyway, so I guess I'll Since I'm not going to attack. I will ooh, that's another good thing that they do though. Ooh, it's a beautiful thing. I love their uh assault garrison. No 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 no. I never do age I never do pure general assassinations. Because they just spawn infinitely. And there are, you know, whatever. Um, but this, Assaulting the Patrol, that's a, I was using that one too all the time. It was awesome. So I'll pick their noble horse and try it. Look at that, 82% success. Now because I'm so excited about it, it'll fail. She'll probably get wounded. Sighild, represent. Well, you can put some leg into it, is what you could have done, but, but uh, you know, yeah, I'm going to set up a, a whole deal going on here. What's going on? What can we do? This guy's a bad dude. I will, uh, uh Will it just do the garrison? Yeah, just the garrison. So I'll try... I'll try some, uh... And it's more expensive. I'll try this. Look at this! I think the, the game just wants this faction gone and is trying to help me be less bad. I believe that's what's happening. I think I believe that because it's true. But there were lots of things I believed because I thought they were true and I ended up being wrong. That's happened many times. But not today. Uh, so hopefully I'm defensing mode here. Friggin' badass agent card, but he's a dumbass. Uh, look at that. Alright, we're gonna end the turn. Wow, 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 wow. Will they attack? Will the boys attack? Boy? No attack from the boy. Oh, I got freaking assassinated. No, Sighild! No, she's down here. Okay. Damn your eyes. That general just maxed out. Like, he just, he was on his... See? Look at this! Stacking growth. 
and uh, they have no food because I destroyed it. Unbelievable. And then these things again. Do they matter? Question mark. No matter how well you do at these, you get tr you get realm divide later. <sighs> we'll just uh. Son of a bastard. Tribal. Man, that's. He better be good. 16% support cost to recruit this fool. And money. This guy costs nothing. And he's in, of, the, of the clan. I believe he's of the clan. Elder. I don't remember how they break it down in the Germanic. Anyway, uh, that was infuriating that die with that. See what happens? You take forever. Meanwhile, they've totally rebolstered. Look at this! And I'm sure this is repaired. Yep. They're... Ah, die with that. I don't like it. I'm gonna... What was that, dear? Well. Oh, Siggy. Siggy will be, uh, active shortly. I am out of time, though. Thank you for watching, and, uh, see you next time. Have a good one.